Hi, in this video we are going to take a look at how to create a stock item in real books. To do that, navigate to masters, click on inventory and click on items and choose the option create. Now uh, you can put the item code, okay, which is not compulsory. Uh, the item code is not compulsory, but you can put the item name like this. And then uh, here you need to select the item group, okay. Item group means category of the item. So let's say this item falls under this category, select it. And of course you can create a new category from here itself. And uh, base unit means the unit of this item. So suppose this, this will be the unit of that item, select it. And if you want to enable batch like this, is this particular item is manufactured, you buy it and you want to track Suppose the expiry of the item, you have to enable it. If it is a service item, enable it. If it is not, don't enable. It's like, suppose you are providing services, you enable. But in this case, I'm showing how we create a stock. Make sure effect in stock is ticked. That is when it is a, an item that will affect inventory. Um, then you can set also the price of this item okay you can set the price of this item like from this from an amount of maybe this to that but we are not going to cover price level today so we are just showing how to create the item you just simply click save like this and this item has been created okay if you want to view the item again, remember I did not give it a code. You can go to, maybe suppose you want to edit or view it. You can just go to all like this. Items, put all, means you want to see all items. Just simply click search button like this. And all the items will come once, will display automatically. So here is it. This is that particular item you can see over here. And then uh, suppose you wanted to edit it, you could have edited it. So this is how we create a stock item in real books. Okay. Hope this video is informative. Thank you for taking time to watch this.